What's going on you guys? This is a Max Gadier, another Dell Latitude E5550. Gonna be upgrades. So what you guys need to do is either get a... I'm gonna be using a mini Phillips screwdriver. I think this one's gonna look a lot better. This is AC Delco brand. So it's got two screws here in the middle, two in the right, and two in the left. So I'm going to take a flathead mini screwdriver and I'm going to lift this up the back side. It should come out. So it's ready, has a solid state drive in here. I'm gonna upgrade the memory to 16 gigs. It's got a total eight gigs, and uh, I'm gonna upgrade the battery, the newer one I'm installed, the same one. Looks like it's missing the caddy here for the for the solar state drive here, like a plastic caddy that holds it down. But well, that's okay. I'm just gonna disconnect it. So guys, I'm gonna show you I'm gonna probably use the 850 Pro Series 256 solid state drive, it's a two and a half inch. Or you can use the SanDisk Ultra 2, actually pretty good. Or uh, I actually like the Intel solid state drive, the Pro Series, actually really good, it's a 512 gigs. Also, the Samsung 840 Pro, actually really good quality. And the last one is a Micron, Microns are pretty good. So the best one I'm going to use probably will be probably just the, the Samsung the 850 Pro Series can be the best. I'm going to use that instead. Let's move around. What I'll do is I'm going to take a double sided tape. I'm just going to go like this. But if you want, you can just order online the part for it. They sell it. Mine didn't come with it. Just got it like that, so that's fine. That should hold on pretty well. Now what I will do is. Upgrade the, I'm going to remove the battery, install the new one. So there's one screw in the left, one in the right. And what you have to do is you're going to take a flat head mini screwdriver. See where the battery connector connected to the motherboard? And you have to pull it down gently. And it comes out. So this is the same battery. I have a new one. So you lift this up gently like this. 
and there's gonna be cable in the back you have to go around like this and you're gonna disconnect it battery cable comes out you're gonna connect the battery cable like I can't connect it back so what I'll do is I'll take a flathead mini screwdriver and gently now you're gonna put the wires back and you're gonna connect it back to the motherboard battery cable and gently Now I'm going to be upgrading the RAM. And the RAM I'm guys going to be using is a Crucial. Yeah, I'll put it in the description so you guys can see it. You can buy online. Total 16 gigs, that's to a total 8 gig per each DIMM. And this is double sided tape I'm using is uh, 3M. They also sell online. So we're gonna press it down gently. And when the last screw here in the middle and the top I have to install. I see it turns on. I'm clicking F2 in the bio settings. So system memory change, okay, click off F1. Yeah, I'm all set to go. Let's look at the battery. So new battery is installed. 
I'm going to exit. See you guys, this will be the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.